Hi everyone and welcome to a special edition of Newegg TV. Today we're going to be exploring some innovative new storage solutions brought to us by Seagate, one of the top data storage manufacturers in the world. Over here on my left we have several products from the GoFlex family. These are external hard drives that are made to be upgradable as you upgrade your computer's hardware. So for example, if you add a new external interface such as USB 3.0, you can upgrade your external hard drive so it's compatible with that new standard. Over here on my right, we have a Seagate Momentus XT. This is a 500 gigabyte hybrid hard drive, meaning it uses both magnetic hard drive storage technology as well as newer SSD technology. There's 500 gigs on the platters, and there's four gigs in the NAND flash memory of the SSD. Using both of these technologies together, Seagate has brought us a drive that has much more capacity, but costs a fraction of the amount you would pay for an SSD. So let's start out by taking a closer look at the GoFlex system. Now, right here we have two versions of their drives. We have a 500 gigabyte 2.5 inch drive, as well as a 2 terabyte 3.5 inch drive. And I've got them here without their base adapters on them. The adapters connect pretty simply by this recessed portion here, which has both a serial ATA power and serial ATA data connector. Yes. Now, both drives come uh, with USB 2.0 adapters, such as the ones seen here. 3.5 inch drive simply drops onto the dock like so. And then here on the back of the dock you have your USB 2.0 port as well as a power plug. So for our 2.5 inch drive here we have the standard USB 2.0 adapter and that snaps in just like that. And then you have a pretty standard USB 2.0 external hard drive. Now if the situation arises that you upgrade your computer or maybe you get an add-on card for USB 3.0 you can simply purchase the USB 3.0 adapter, as mentioned, snaps in just like that, and now you've upgraded to USB 3.0 connection speed. They also have adapters for FireWire 800 available and a powered eSATA adapter. And one thing to mention about the eSATA adapter, if you are a system builder, you might be familiar with a bracket such as this one. It has an external serial ATA port on the back and a data cable that you run along and plug into your motherboard. Now, important to mention, this will only provide data, so it actually won't work with this eSATA bracket that they provide for the GoFlex drive. So, this will only work with a powered eSATA port. It's also known as USB power over eSATA. Uh, so there's some notebooks that have that, but if you do have that port available, this is a very fast connector for your external hard drive. Now the benefit of the GoFlex system is obviously the flexibility to upgrade your storage solutions along with your computer. So you'll especially notice from these benchmarks here, if you're upgrading from USB 2.0 to USB 3.0, the difference in data transfer speeds is pretty impressive and you'll definitely notice a difference right off the bat. Now one final caveat before we move on is if you're planning on investing in GoFlex, I recommend either sticking with the 2.5 inch drive or a 3.5 inch drive. The reason being, the 3.5 inch drive here is not compatible with the adapters for the 2.5 inch drive. Similarly, your 2.5 inch drive here will not fit onto the dock for your 3.5 inch drive. That being said, if you use multiple computers in different environments and you need to move data around a lot, the GoFlex system is fantastic for making sure that you're using the optimal transfer rate for whatever projects you're working on. So next we have the Seagate Momentus XT. This is a 500 gigabyte hybrid drive. Now again, a hybrid drive means that it uses both magnetic storage technology as well as NAND flash memory uh, that SSDs use. There have been hybrid drives in the past, as early as 2005, but they've really never, the drives that made it to market really have never provided either the performance or the price to performance ratio that most consumers have wanted. Now the Momentus XT actually has a built-in algorithm, so it's independent of the operating system and it will determine which data you access on the drive most often. It will preload that data onto the SSD portion of the drive, so when you're accessing it, so for instance loading your operating system or accessing commonly used programs or files, you'll find that they load much, much more quickly. And definitely a lot more quickly than you would with a standard mag magnetic hard drive. So as you can see from the benchmarks, the performance of the Momentus XT actually improved over time as we tested it more and more often. That's because the algorithm in the drive was learning what data we were going to access and was preloading the information onto the SSD portion of the drive. Now if you go and look up 500 gigabyte SSD drives that are available right now, you'll find that the Momentus XT costs about one-tenth of the price of those.
Obviously, the performance of a pure SSD drive is going to trump that of the Momentus XT, but if you're looking for a more budget solution to give your computer a little bit more pep, and the hard drive is usually the biggest bottleneck in any modern computer, you'll find that you can actually get the Momentus XT, improve your load times, improve your boot up times, and you won't have to throw down the amount of cash that you would for one of those SSD drives. That's all for today. Thank you everyone for watching, and we'll see you next time on Newegg TV.